Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so as you're working through the work in the textbook, you're going to be coming up with answers that are different in the back. You'll notice that in this, these materials that I gave you, that we got quite um, accurate with some of these conversions. We got into four decimal places, uh, three decimal places, and etc. cetera. Um, your textbook isn't using that um, accurate of conversions. These are what they're using. They're saying that there's about 1.6 kilometers in a mile. They're saying there's about 2.5 centimeters in an inch, where we were calling that 2.54. So that'll make a difference in your answers, whether or not you're using 2.5 or 2.54. Um, I'm okay with either one that you use. These, um, the, so one mile is approximately 1.6 kilometers, one inch is approximately 2.5 centimeters. A yard is pretty close to a meter. There's 450 grams in a pound. There's about 2.2 pounds in a kilogram. There's four liters in a gallon. One tablespoon is approximately equal to 15 milliliters. And there's 30 milliliters in one fluid ounce. Now, I would say to get along in life, if you knew all of these, your life would be so much easier if you just knew them and was able to use them. I would say I use probably the top one, two, three, four, five, six of them. I don't use the bottom two very often. Um, and certainly it's something that I can always look up with Google or with my phone these days. It's not a big deal. Um, I made a little list of the things that I think that we probably should know. Um, Imperial. You, you really should know that a foot is equal to 12 inches, and I'm going to test you on that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask you. I won't tell you that a foot is 12 inches. I think you should know that. That a yard is about three feet, and since a yard is pretty close to a meter, what that means is a meter is pretty close to three feet. It's actually 3.3 uh, feet to be um, accurate, um, but not an S. So, one yard is three feet, one meter is 3.3 feet, a pound is 16 ounces, I think you should know that. I think it's pretty important to know this too, that a pound is 450 grams. So that's two ways of looking at this. 450 grams is a pound. One ounce, now that's not a fluid ounce, that's a weight, is about 28 grams. That one you don't use too often. In metric, you need to know that a kilometer is a thousand meters, that a meter is a hundred centimeters, and one centimeter is ten millimeters. Okay, so a meter stick is a hundred centimeters, which means a hundred centimeters is pretty close to three feet, 3.3 uh, feet to be exact. You should know this, that a mile is 1.6 kilometers. Now, we might want to know that it's 1.61, but if we remember that it's 1.6, that's going to get us through life. An inch is 2.5 centimeters. Now, this is more accurate, but if we remember that it's 2.5, then that's going to get us through life. A U.S. gallon is about 4 liters. It's a little under, but if that's a rough conversion that we should know. And again, a pound is 454 kilograms, or pretty close to 450 grams. Remember, the kilo means multiply by 1,000, so that decimal would be moved over once, twice, three. And another nice way of remembering kilograms and pounds is each kilogram is approximately 2.2 pounds. So when you go to buy something in the store, sometimes they have it in kilograms, sometimes they have it in pounds. It's important to know that a kilogram is actually 2.2 pounds. So again, these are the ones that I think you should know. I'm, uh, let's see, one yard is one meter. I think we should add that one too. One yard is approximately one meter. Where the meter's a little bit, a little bit longer. Okay, and again, that was, it's about three feet. And uh, a foot is 12 inches, and, and so on and so on. So I'm going to just give you a chance to look at this, and I'm going to suggest that you pause the video and copy it down. And these are the things that we really should know um, moving forward. Okay, guys.